Hounds is a psychedelic rock and roll band. We love to be inspired by music from the 50s. We love older music. We try to play what we feel mostly. Music is more a calling than anything. Everywhere around St. Louis is so much more popular than the actual city itself. There's all these weird little sections. You know, we grew up in the suburbs, the outskirts of the city. We had all known each other since we were this tall. I met Logan in second grade. As long as he's playing the drums, he's smiling. It's just that infectious energy that he kind of feeds to everybody else. Jack was in the same school district. We were all going to school together. I mean, we're like family. Jordan's absolutely the leader of the ship. He very much works at this 24 hours a day. It wasn't until later on that we started playing music together. I sat back in my wicked chair just fumbling, fighting swears. You know, I never quite know, never quite know if you're there. But I swear it's worth it when she does me like she do. Hounds was the result of a bunch of kids being tired of being treated like kids. We had been coming out of this phase where we were this pop rock group. that We weren't sure what we were doing or who we were trying to be. It was starting to feel a little like we needed to do something different. We just wanted to go and create rock and roll music that really was imperfect because that's the stuff that we love. Being able to talk to Joe Edwards, who owns most of the venues here that matter, and to have his support, I think, shows us that St. Louis is on our side. I wanted to yeah. name the room a name that touring bands from around the world would remember. The Duck Room rhymes with so many words. Yeah. <laughs> like, like fire truck. Like fire truck, yeah. And good luck. And good, yeah, there the you go. The first note that we played on this stage <laughs> was an absolute disaster. It was absolutely a disaster. My guitar was just slightly, horribly out of tune, and so it's like, yeah. boom, we dumb. It's amazing when I think about the path of the journey, the way that this has all come together. Tonight on Who Will Rock You? Pounds! Who will rock you? Those words make me smile for so many different reasons. There was such varied influences in there. I was hearing some Beatles skiffle music from the Cavern Club, and I know how much pot the drummer smokes. Oh Enough pot! Hey, look at, Enough look at you pot! You're awesome! That. You caught me. I, that was great. That experience was really a shock. It was just like a new like emotional high. Playing music for 10 or 11 years, we have never done anything like this. And the winner of Who Will Rock You is... Hounds! Who Will Rock You? I guess we... We rock. We will or did or have or Everybody will. Rocks. This has been incredible. I felt like we were in a good spot. Maybe I was in the right place at the right time and that we should definitely be doing music. Hounds! Walking away with $50,000 and an exclusive development deal with BMG. Being able to walk away saying we won, it was the affirmation that I was hoping for.